welcome. This is Melissa Arm with the Stock Swoosh. We're going to take in here a look at the market. This is the QQQ's really big move down for the Q's today. In fact, we set the low for the day at, let's look at exactly. Let's be exact. 1013, 455.63, like an angel. <laughs> Although that really wasn't any specific number whatsoever at all. But anyways, we sold off like a hot cake yesterday. The biggest sell off this market has had the entire year of 2024. And then when you look at what happened today here too, you have to say, whoa, wait a minute. But it's a tricky market. So again, people try to come in and buy the dip today and we've got you know, a little bit more than an hour left. The market could close like this though. <clears throat> I gotta be honest with you, it could close pretty much flat or with a little baby green or a little baby red. I don't think we're gonna have any extension today to the upside or downside either way. Uh, you know, it's very interesting here because you either have conviction or you don't have conviction and that's whatever you think. So either you have conviction, the sell-off that we've had for the last umpteen days is over and we're going to bounce and then you should go long or you have conviction that we're going to sell off like a hot cake and we're lower and you have conviction of the short side and you're short. So you can't wishy-wash it. You also can't go long and short the market at the same time. That's a disaster. You have no conviction when you do that. So if you shorted the market today and went long the market today, even if you made money doing it, it was a stupid, stupid, stupid thing to do. You never get conviction in anything, real conviction. The type of conviction that allows you to make lot, gobs of money in the market if you're back and forth in different directions in the same stock or ticker symbol on the same day. You have to read what's going on here in the gap. And today, actually, I gotta be honest with you, we were down this morning. We were way, way down this morning. Then we had some data, then we lifted. Technically, we opened flat today. There really was no gap here today. We we're pretty much neutral, neutral here this morning, but we were actually down at one point this morning. Um, let's, in fact, let's go to the spy. Yeah, wow, it's so rare for the market to open flat, but that is exactly what happened here today. Look, we really didn't gap in the market today, which is strange, strange actually, so rare, almost never happens. But it absolutely did today, and that has added to the volatility as well because people are indecisive of what to do. And I'm not that way. I'm not that way at all. Um, but just know that if you are indecisive, the best thing you could do is step back, take a break, and don't be in any trades because you're going to lose if you're indecisive. You have to have 100% conviction with whatever you do. Again, whatever your directional bias is, okay, in the trade. But just looking at the market, Today confirms really the volatility and it's gonna last and it's not over and this is gonna continue and there's no earnings tonight or tomorrow morning that are gonna affect this market. So anything that would affect this market the next 24 hours to end out this week, which would be the most bearish week this market's had all of 2024, would be uh, tomorrow morning we have some data. So we have some data out at 8.30, which could affect the market and then we have a consumer sentiment number at 10 a.m., which is a bigger, a big, big number, and that's gonna be after the open. So very interesting market, can't wait to see what happens. I love to short, we've had some huge shorts in many, many different ticker symbols this week in stocks. We did short the market this morning as a day trade. We got in, we got out, it worked. We were out way, way before the lows. We did a quick trade, but it, it's been really nice trading. And the volatility is good if you know what to do. So I'm just, you know, my my tip of the day, stock switch tip of the day is to have conviction in the direction you trade and do not do two different directions in the same ticker symbol, particularly the market, on the same day. If you're interested in more information, learning what I know, and taking the Golden Gap course, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Have a great day.